Hey everybody, welcome back to Guns and Gadgets, your source for Second Amendment news uh, in the Mobile Command Center, and this news is aggravating enough that I wanted to just pull over and tell you about it. Uh, two days ago, Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell was on a uh, podcast on iHeartRadio. I will have the link in the description down below if you want to listen to it. It's about an 18-minute clip, uh, and it was on the uh, the Terry Miner Show. He's based out of Kentucky, where uh, Mitch McConnell lives. And among other things, uh, gun control came up and what the plan, what the Senate plans to do once they come back from their August break. And their first day back is uh, September 9th. Yeah, September 9th. Sorry. I got some notes. Their first day back is September 9th. And uh, in his own words, Mitch McConnell said that an assault weapon ban is, on, is uh, quote, front and center. So an assault weapon ban is on the table. Uh, he did reference the previous AWB ban of the 10 years, and if there was a lot of uh, back and forth on when it did, when it, whether it did any good or not. Uh, but he did say that, that they would be talking about an assault weapon ban. Uh, he also said, and there were some quotes that are very fear, infuriating, he did say uh, that uh, what we can't do is fail to pass something. So he prefers to pass some type of law. And he's mentioned it several times in this, in this uh, 18-minute clip. He also said that he expects something to happen in the, and I'm paraphrasing, uh, in the background checks, like an enhanced background check or the red flag bill uh, for, you know, for the nation federally. But he did stress that the Senate will take up background checks and that they are right now during their break, uh, they are having discussions right now. He also said that on Monday last week, he had a conference call with the FBI director and some key Senate members uh, to explore what could be done to address the mass shootings. So there you have it right from the horse's mouth. Red flag bills, enhanced background checks, and possibly another assault weapon ban. They're all in play when, the, uh, when Congress reconvenes in September. Uh, what you need to do right now, I know people don't want to hear it, but you have to do it. Call these clowns now. Call your representatives, call your senators, and let them know that this is not the way to respond. The whole country doesn't need to pay for a couple of deranged individuals. That's what they're trying to make us do. They're going to slowly chip away at our Second Amendment rights, our First Amendment rights, our Fifth Amendment rights, our Fourth, uh, Fourteenth Amendment rights, uh, they're, and the Sixth Amendment. There are all kinds of our constitutional civil rights that are involved with these red flags. Uh, it's not the right thing to do. It's an unconstitutional thing to do. And make sure when you're when you're talking to your reps, you ask them to stand up for a roll call vote when they do have these things up for vote. And you're going to hear more about that in another video because that will ensure we get to know how they vote so we can hold them accountable. So just figured I wanted to let you know what was going on. Uh, I hope you're, <laughs> you're not driving like I was. I wanted to to crash so uh, please drive safely and uh, let me know in the uh, comment section what you think do you think that this is the right thing to do do you have a better uh, thought that maybe nobody's ever thought about uh, maybe you have a, one that congress can't think of i don't know uh, where we go from here but i do know if we sit by and do nothing and stay quiet then we're in a heap of trouble so please, if you enjoy this type of news as fast as it happens on the Second Amendment, you need to do yourself a favor and subscribe to that channel right down below. Subscribe to Guns and Gadgets so you can stay up to date with all of the news, no matter where it happens in the nation, whether it's good, bad, ugly, or indifferent, right here on Guns and Gadgets. Until we see each other again, be safe, stay vigilant, and carry your weapon. Take care, everybody.